Niagara Falls STEM curriculum is in place for students from pre-K to high school. News 4's Angela Christophoros explains how it benefits them academically. academically excuse me. Uh, Christy, well, first off, STEM stands for Science, Technology, Engineering, and Math. The teaching concept isn't new, but district officials say Niagara Falls is the first in the state to incorporate STEM education across an entire school district. LaSalle Prep 7th graders spent the morning working on the next phase of a STEM project. It involved scale models of a home they made out of papers and straws. Now they're working in their science classes to um, determine the energy efficiency of their home. How, how well does it retain heat? How can they improve its ability to retain heat? And they're working to insulate that home right now. This classroom is one of several district-wide that incorporates STEM, or science, technology, engineering, and math into interactive learning. The focus behind this is jobs. If you look into the data, it tells you that the jobs that are going to be available for our students as they graduate are in STEM fields. This academic school year is the first year STEM education has been a part of all 11 schools of the Niagara Falls City School District. McGrath says the educational exposure is especially important for students in what's considered a high needs district. I feel like our district is unique because we do start young with them. We expose them to careers in elementary school. We don't wait until they they, you know, become high school students. They're already learning about engineering careers in elementary school. McGrath says STEM activity takes place in schools across the district on a daily basis. She says it improves students' interest in the subjects and knowledge that can be applied to real-world experiences in the future. Of 35 STEM students who took a survey, 69% plan on pursuing a STEM-related career. So, Angela, is STEM also offered in other local school districts? Yes, it is, actually, in districts like the Buffalo Public Schools. There's also a national STEM education coalition that works to raise awareness in Congress about the need for STEM education across the country. All right, Angela, thanks so much.